during your interview with Eric, I've been kind of staring at that logo behind you of the International Association of Firefighters who have sponsored our interview set. And I'm looking at the words that say tradition and commitment. Boy, is that true. I mean, nationally and locally, we could not do this without the firefighters. They are just out there helping us all the time. And every Labor Day, you see them on the streets. They're like an army out there at every intersection. I just get uh, such a thrill to see them out there collecting every year, and they work so hard. Um, let's take a look at their actual work on the streets. Like the past 20 some years, Fairfax County Fire and Rescue and Local 2068 has collected on street side for Fill the Boot as part of the IFF, Muscular Dystrophy Fill the Boot campaign. On-duty crews go to a major intersection in their first alarm territory, in their response area, and they're on the street corners uh, collecting from, uh, from the citizens and visitors, whoever's passing through, uh, with a boot. None of this would be possible without like, the relationship with the Board of Supervisors, the senior staff, and then, of course, the citizens that we're uh, collecting money from. There are some that have been to camp, and it's incredible to see these kids have a normal camp experience. It's incredible to me and anyone that goes down to camp. It's very special to be able to help muscular dystrophy, and you know, not, not only the kids, we focus a lot on the kids, but there's also a lot of adults getting, uh, getting a lot of uh, benefit over uh, after our dollars. Thank you very much. For the past five years, we've been number one and number two in the nation and for the past three years, we've collected over $500,000 uh, each year. Doing a fill the boot for Muscular Dystrophy Association. I've been involved in Muscular Dystrophy since the inception of the union, 2702, back in 79. The past two years, we've collected well over $60,000 each time. So we went from 3,000, 4,000, we jumped to 15,000, and then we got people motivated. So we're well up over 60,000 a year now. Still hadn't caught with Fairfax County yet, but, but we're doing our part. We went out and adopted some MDA kids. Each shift has one. We bring them into a big kickoff. That gets everybody motivated. With the three children we, we have coming in, I believe two of them are, are in the wheelchairs that the money we collect helps pay for. And it doesn't get much better, especially for them. It makes it so easy for them to get around. You can see the joy in their face once they've mastered it. And it doesn't take long to master those wheelchairs. So yes, we see exactly where it goes. This year we have a goal of $70,000, and with the help of the citizens of the city of Fairfax, uh, and we'll make that goal. Without their support and help, uh, and their smiles, when they're handing us a change, it go goes a long way. The Loudoun County Fire Department's been helping MBA for many years now. Um, we try to set goals high when we do fill the boots and things like that, and just try to get the community and the other members and personnel from the fire department involved in it, whether it's, you know, the career guys sometimes try to get, you know, all the people that are stuck up at the office all the time involved. So just try to help out as much as we can. It is awesome to be able to go to, uh, to be recognized throughout the United States um, as, as a leader in, in the collection for MBA. I think it shows not only that we're there to do our jobs and try to provide the best for our community, but we want to help other people as well. Everybody looks forward to coming to work and do what we do. Plus, we get to do, we get to help out so much for, for, the, for the kids suffering from MD in the, in the Washington, D.C. area. That's what's really incredible, knowing that we're touching those people's lives in such a big way. That tape did a great job of capturing the commitment of our local firefighters, but boy, when you see these firefighters cleaned up and in their uniforms, nothing like it. You got the city of Fairfax firefighters. Please tell us your name and rank. Uh, Dwayne Harmon, Lieutenant. Dave Rohr, Dave Rohr, Fire Chief. Now you switched, uh, you did a little change here. You were with uh, the county before, now you're with the city. I was. Good to see you again. John Bullock, uh, Firefighter. Thank you, John. Now, I understand the city of Fairfax has been doing the fill the boot campaign since 2009, so 11 years. That's a pretty big commitment. Yes, ma'am. I've uh, been doing the fill the boot for the past couple of years, and uh, every year our folks love to get out in the streets and love to collect. Uh, we've actually still have people out in the streets right now, um, you know, uh, pushing it hard to try to just, you know, get that extra dollar and, and more money to, uh, you know, fight muscular dystrophy. Let me ask you, I mean, do the firefighters really get excited about doing this every year? I mean, do you really see that? Do they talk about it and they're really excited? Oh, yeah, this is, uh, I mean, uh, months out, you know, the beginning of the summer is kind of the, when we start having the kickoffs and, 
and uh, they really do get excited to get out there and you, know, you get a chance to meet a, you know, a lot of people on the intersections and it, that just the competition of you know what station can raise the most money and and uh, just kind of that camaraderie is it's really great and I would bet too I think the citizens are probably excited to see you face to face they know that you're there all the time when they need you but it's probably really fun for them in a way to see you out there and let them let you know how much they appreciate you by telling you and also by contributing to MDA because they know how much you're behind it mm. oh yeah. I mean you you get to the, you know when we're collecting first few days there's people who are rolling their windows down and are just excited and waving their dollar bills out there as they're driving by and throwing you money and it's it's really great to to see everybody so excited just uh, to you know fill the boot up and you know raise that extra dollar did you have a good year oh yes we did um, I'm uh, proud to say that uh, we're presenting a check for fifty thousand dollars this year wow. and we will take it let's see the muscles here yeah. <laughs> Excellent. You definitely flexed them big time. Thank you so much, City of Fairfax fire, Firefighters.